and welcome to Finextra. I'm Emily Haller at Cybos 2015 and I'm here with David Kretz of Bank of America Merrill Lynch. Thank you very much for joining me. Thank you. So real-time payments is a huge discussion topic here at Cybos. Is this high profile deserved? Well it does in two regards. One in terms of adoption and second in terms of the benefits. In terms of adoption there are 18 real-time schemes up and running today and roughly the same number under consideration or in development. Some of them have tremendously high rates of adoption in their given countries, so very important topic generally. In terms of the benefits, which of course drives the adoption, I would highlight two. Person to person has tremendous benefits both in terms of reducing cost and convenience. So we would like to see less and less use of cash, less and less use of paper checks, and that's where real time comes in. And then from a business to consumer standpoint, of course, it can tremendously increase the client delight whether it's looking at business to consumer refunds or similar applications, it has tremendous benefits for both the businesses and their clients. What's the implication of real time on bank operations and technology? Well, it's substantial. So of course there's a central infrastructure to be built, which of course takes consensus amongst the participants and the expense. And then of course there's the investment in terms of each of the industry participants hooking to the schemes. It's expensive, but it's worth the effort. Should banks be concerned with new entrants in the payments business? No. We look at new entrants in two ways. One, as competitors that bring new ideas to the table that we frankly need to think about, and two, as partners in both working on the underlying infrastructure and in building front-end applications. David, thank you very much. Thank you. And thank you for watching.